Hi, my name is James with Animals in the Attic Restaurant Division. Even if you don't think you have a rodent problem in your restaurant, every restaurant owner should follow these simple steps. Dry storage areas, super common problem with rodents. You're storing rice, flour, sugar, oils, all kinds of containers that they can chew through and get great food sources. In fact, some of their favorite food sources. Take a look at what's in your dry storage and make sure you don't have grains and pastas and other edible things in cardboard boxes or easily accessible containers. Try a Cambro or a Lexan with a lid to prevent them to getting into your foods. It'll be safer for your customers and save you money. If you have a rat problem in your restaurant, you probably have holes that they've created throughout your baseboards and drywall. Whatever you do, leave those holes until all the rodents are gone, your place is sealed up, and the problem is solved. Then, if you wanna go back and patch those holes for appearances, go ahead. But if you do that, while the problem is still going on, they're gonna chew more holes in your drywall and in your baseboards and create more issues for you. So use those holes, put traps in front of them, but don't close them up because they're gonna chew their way back out. Where do you most often learn about the challenges your competitors are having? Whether it be good or bad, it's coming from one of your purveyors more than likely. The produce guy, the beer guy, the guy who cleans your beer taps, any number of them. Make sure you're discreet in front of them because just as much as they enjoy telling you about other restaurants, they enjoy telling those people about you. Keep it discreet, stop everything when they come in and resume when they're gone. It'll serve you well. Water, it's a critical source for rats and all living things. There's plenty of places to get water in a restaurant. Whether you left some water behind after cleaning the floors or there's water in your drains. Often the large open floor drains create a problem because they never seem to dry out. If you throw ice in the sink, they'll drip all night. So you've got to keep not only the sink dry, but the drains below. And you can do that easily by covering it with a grate you can get from your purveyor or even putting a brick over the top of it. It may sound silly, but remember, you've got a rodent problem and they need water. If you have or think you have a rodent problem in your restaurant, give us a call here at Animals in the Attic Restaurant Division. We will discreetly help you as quickly and professionally as we can.